first of all, my new wig. <laughs> Told you, you can come up here and find anything. So this new wig, I got it from Amazon. I'm into the short wigs. Every now and then I like wearing my long hair, my bald head, my curly hair, my burgundy hair. And now I got blonde. What y'all think? Don't matter. I still like it. It's from Amazon. Okay, I'll link the information below. You know, I usually don't add anything below because I, I don't have enough people to be looking below so I usually just tell you so I tell you what here's the name of the wig because you're looking at the video right so you might as well go ahead and see so I'm doing another goodbye to winter and I'm gonna show you some things and I'll let you know either I wore it probably once or if I never wore it so let's get started all right, so I'm going to do accessories first. So I think what I'm going to do is uh, just go through all the accessories. That way, when you see it here or here, then you'll know I had one of these accessories on. I think the it's one outfit that I did not have accessories on. I didn't have it. I think it's the first outfit. I don't have no, no earrings on. Let's put it that way. So some of the accessories that I am wearing... One is my All Fateful Pearl earrings that I got from Dillard's. You've seen these in quite a few videos. My favorite. And I'm going to have to look for a couple of more because if anything happened to these, I'm going to have to fit. These are one of my favorite hooped with the large hoop and the small hoop pearl earrings. So I got these from Dillard's. Matter of fact, I think I'll film me going to Dillard's and look around at their uh, jewelry, earrings, rings. I think I'll do that. Next thing is I got these nice earrings from um, Saks Fifth when I went to Orlando. Aren't these nice? I just love it because it reminds me of hoops, but then it's got the, the odd shape. See the odd shape of it on both sides? And it's trimmed in gold, and then it has the gold shell top. Nice, right? And then these, if you've seen it in my videos, I got these from Aldo's Shoes. They have cute little earrings in there. If you ever go to look at their shoes, and you know I got quite a, a few pumps from there. But... Their jewelry is cute too. So this reminds me of Versace. So this is a pair that I had gotten from there. This is my earrings from Target. I've just showed, if you've seen my video where I, I don't even know what I'm showing on that video. I think it's, I don't know. Child, don't get me to lie. But this is a pair of the earrings that I showed. It's my Target run. Um, I did a little Target show of some things I got from Target. And then this silver ring with the oval. And then it's got the probably, if it's real, honey, I don't know. But I got it from a consignment store. I know the silver is definitely real. Very nice. I like it. Mm. Um, and the necklace that I am wearing is this very pretty um, gold plated. Uh, and it's got um, little pearls in it entangled in the intertwined in the necklace um, when I was cruising oh, I love cruising um, I like to buy um, some of the jewelry they be having because it lasts a long time and this is one of the necklaces I had what they have is a whole lot of it and you just cut what you want 
and I had this letter D. I hope you could see it, that it's a D. But every time when I film, it looked like it's turned the other way, so I just do it both ways. But it's my letter D for my name, which is Danita. Pretty light. And then I'm wearing this necklace. And it is the letter A for age is how you wear it. And so I put this on as well. Both of the, uh, this necklace I got, you know how you order, I think it was Nordstrom Rack. Yep, Nordstrom Rack. I got the letter A for age is how you wear it. So that is all of the jewelry. So now let's move on to the clothes. Now, you know I film, I say this all the time, I film the look one day, and then later on I come and I'll film the talking portion of it. So I had to write down what I wore because I really, truly forgot. Okay, so outfit number one, the dress. Is by in other stories this is a beautiful knit dress it is a oatmeal color now it look it when you showing it it doesn't look like much it look like oh it's gonna be frumpy but it comes with its own belt I'm gonna show you a picture of how I wore it with the belt and then here is how I'm wearing it with uh the goodbye to winter outfit and what i did was i chose to put um well anyway let me do this first speaking of in other stories their clothes are beautiful i love it okay so and i was so excited they reached out and said that they would love to tag my dress no, they didn't. They don't know nothing about my YouTube channel. I don't have enough people for them to care. But they did want to feature my dress, me wearing my dress on their channel. And that that's nice for this grandma. Okay, so with it, I wore this belt. I decided to because I'm wearing the... Okay, so the belt that I'm wearing is this... Um, cream, I decided, not cream color, the tan belt to go with the Tory Burch boots to bring it out. The browns and hat I wore was my Gucci hat, um, the bucket hat. I thought it was so cute. And of course, you know I bid for it off of Vestier. My misguided top. Um, this is uh, more one of those, what do they call them? I call them sweatshirt tops. But they got the um, and the squared um, shoulders. And I just love this blue color. So nice. Yeah, this is from Misguided. Looks pretty good on me too. And I... Wore these, wore these black jeans. They're the black coated um, jeans and these are from Seven Mankind, Seven of Mankind. They feel really good and they stretch. Um, this is my first time wearing these jeans and I've had them since 2019. And I got these from Saks as well. They feel really good. And see, it has the Seven of Mankind on the pocket and on the back. And to me, they high-waisted. And they're really nice. I don't believe I didn't wear these all. Because this is a dressy to me. These are a dressy jean. But I wanted to show it in a non-dressy um I wanted to show it in a non-dressy outfit. And the shoes I wore with these. Let me see. What shoes did I wear? I wore my H&M boots. So you see the black H&M boots. And um, let's move on to the next one. So the next one is my thrifted brown dress. 
I really like this dress. It's only my second time wearing it. I just love the sleeves on it. Anything that looks different. Um, this is also a knit dress. It came with its own little flimsy belt, but I didn't like it. So the color of, of course, it's the color of the season, but I would have bought it anyway. It's just a beautiful brown. Beautiful for me to pull out all any other winter. Does not matter to me. And I wore my Amazon fedora hat with that. Those boots um, go with everything. And I bought them last year from Steve Madden. So those are some nice boots. Okay, so the next thing is, let's see, which one of these do I want to do? All right, so I got another top that's similar to the one by Misguided, except it is a cream one from H&M. See the, the shoulders, all the same except that it's cream and I just love a nice cream um, shirt because with that cream shirt is these from H&M. These, I call them pants, but I guess you could say they're not tights because to me, sometimes tight, I don't know. But I, I guess it's their loungewear tights pants put all in one what i liked about them is first of all they're ribbed they're thick and even though you can't see it they have a split and by with me being short i have to really put these up in or up my waist in order for you to see the split because i'm five three so i wore this with my Ugg um, boots, and I got a lot of wear out of those because in Florida, you throw them on with a pair of shorts and a little t-shirt and a little thin jacket, that's your winner. Right there, all in a nutshell. All, all you need to wear. Um, and the hat I wore, let me make sure, because uh, did I wear a hat? Mm, okay, I wore last outfit is this H&M shirt um, sweater. It's very thin. It looks like it's itchy, but it's not. And it's got this beautiful, it's actually pearls. You would think it was, well, it's got the little fake diamonds as well, but it's got the pearls in it. Um, look at my nails, y'all. What y'all think? They are butterflies. Can you see the little butterflies on it? <laughs> I'm so extra. Mm. Yeah. But anyway, I thought this was so pretty. I got it for sale. And I think it was like one of them sales where you get it on sale inside the store. Going inside H&M, you get better sales. If nobody's never told you. But I think I paid like $11 for this. It is so beautiful. And I wore it with these jeans from New York and Company, which I've never seen them sell again. I haven't seen them at least. And it's got the little embellishment going down the pants. And then at the end, it has the distress. I really like these jeans. I wore my lack of color with that um, H&M cream um, shirt and those tights. And... I wore my beautiful, I still keep everything on it, my beautiful lack of color cream fedora. And it's got the hard brim. Oh, I just ordered another one. Oh. Mm. 
I can't wait to show it to you. In the stage you're in, you are beautiful. Bye, guys.